my project was on Frederick II and the medieval Muslims, looking at rulership, expulsion, and crusade. I examined his relationship with the Muslims within his own Sicilian kingdom, as well as the Muslims that he dealt with while on crusade. My project was entitled, A Comparison of Stress Levels Between Student-Athletes and Non-Athletes at a Division III Institution. The first hypothesis was that stress levels between student-athletes and non-athletes would be significantly different. The second hypothesis was that stress levels would be positively correlated with higher levels of psychological distress with all participants. What it takes to be a goddess, examining the relationship between queens and divinity in ancient Egypt. I looked at four great royal wives during the 18th dynasty in ancient Egypt and studied how they became divine during their lifetimes and death. Using angler surveys to record recreational fishing interactions with turtles in the Chesapeake Bay. Basically a way to record uh, recreational fishing activity and the way these fishermen interacted with a common endangered species in the Chesapeake Bay area. The title of my project is a directed evolution of pectin methylesterase to higher activity. The goal of my research is to develop a method for the economical production of biofuels by genetically engineering enzymes to degrade agricultural waste into usable product. The relationships among cultural competence, studying abroad, and future career opportunities. An overview on the current literature of studying abroad and culture and how cultural competence will affect future career opportunities in students. A Bittersweet Alliance, how ticked off Italians and Cavalier OSS operatives helped win World War II. Talking about the OSS and Italian partisan interaction during the Italian campaign of World War II uh, and how they were instrumental in the eventual success of the Allied forces. Love thy ideal neighbor, permitted and forbidden relationships in utopian fiction. My paper is essentially about what happens to interpersonal relationships, families, romance, friendships, when placed in the context of a society that's ideal or less than ideal. 